With COVID cases proceeding to spike in America and abroad, explorers with a United States identification remain grounded. Until this point in time, only nine nations are available to Americans without limitations. In the event that Belarus, Serbia, Zambia or any of the other six nations on that rundown aren't likely, at that point voyagers tingling to get on a global flight should stand by. How long is as yet unclear. Elizabeth Becker, writer of Overbooked, The Exploding Business of Travel and Tourism, takes note of that the pandemic wrecked the $8 trillion worldwide travel industry short term. Those fundamental mainstays of 21st century worldwide travel, open boundaries, open objections, and sans visa travel, will not return temporarily or even medium term, she says. What's the significance here for the fate of movement? In spite of the choppiness, specialists are seeing blue skies. Bruce Poon Tip, creator of Unlearn. The year the Earth stood still and the organizer of movement organization G Adventures, says not exclusively will we travel once more, we'll improve. I actually accept travel can be the greatest wholesaler of abundance the world has at any point seen, he says. This respite gives us the endowment of time to consider how we can travel all the more deliberately. From a restored obligation to supportable the travel industry to innovative approaches to globetrot from home, here's the manner by which travel creators, bloggers, and podcasters are exploring. Number 8. Sustainability will be a main thrust one silver covering of the pandemic? Purchasers are multiplying down on maintainability. Becker predicts explorers will assume the job of concerned residents requesting mindful travel approaches. The business will react with dynamic measures to focus on a solid world over overall revenues. Try not to be astounded if nations command, sans fly days and different measures to control environmental change, she says. Make a move. Reduce your carbon impression by buying counterbalances with organizations like Cool Effect and by remaining at affirmed green lodgings. Check destinations like Book Different, which rates facilities for eco-agreeableness. Number 7. Our excursions will turn out to be more comprehensive The Black Lives Matter development has exposed the issue of portrayal in all ventures, including travel. That is past due, says Sarah Greaves Gabadon. The honor-winning columnist in TV have says she trusts the business is advancing toward significant change yet stresses that any change might be fleeting. At the point when the pandemic is passed and the hashtags are done moving, will industry watchmen still be anxious to pull in, oblige, and praise explorers of shading? She writes in an email. I'm mindfully idealistic yet not totally persuaded. Dark Travel Alliance's Martinique Lewis feels the business is moving the correct way and stays cheerful. She takes note of that organizations are tending to the requirements of assorted clients and says it's regarding time. Interestingly they are thinking about what a trans female goes through not just while picking what restroom to go in at an eatery, yet when she looks into an inn and her permit shows an alternate individual, says Lewis. Presently hefty size explorers needing to surf and scuba yet can't on the grounds that the absence of wetsuits in their size are being recognized. Presently visually impaired voyagers who actually need to encounter visits and outrageous games while on vacation are considered. Make a move. Visit one of the almost 200 living history exhibition halls in the US, where notable translators depict figures from an earlier time. They shed light on excruciating issues, like prejudice in America, and covered up accounts, like those of minorities, whose accounts have been stifled. Number 6. Small people group will assume a greater part voyagers can have an effect in humble communities that were at that point battling financially before the pandemic. Kaz Makepeace of Y Travel Blog says she and her family have consistently headed out gradually to lesser-known regions, instead of hustling through objections. Now she's supporting these spots by disparaging neighborhood organizations and giving to philanthropies. Kate Newman of Travel for Difference proposes explorers center around, worldwide south, or agricultural nations that rely upon the travel industry. We need to expand our areas to stay away from mass the travel industry and spotlight on the spots that truly need it, she says. Seeing such countless networks endure during COVID-19 has exposed this issue. Make a move. 
Return to economical the travel industry instructive and promotion charitable impact travel alliance to figure out how to enable local people and ensure the climate. Number 5. We'll look for quality over amount high mileage voyagers are placing more idea into their lists of must dos Coronavirus has permitted me to re-examine how and why I travel, says Eric Prince of the Minority Nomad. It's given me the opportunity to investigate travel projects for energy rather than the check. Rather than zeroing in on paid gigs, the blogger, who lives in Thailand, says he'll set out on a self-supported task to feature outside of what might be expected regions in his received country. Yolanda Osejidi, of Hey Dip Your Toes In, is putting the brakes on worldwide excursions, referring to Go as an advantage many underestimate. Advantage comes in numerous structures, and the demonstration of perceiving our movement-related ones have called us to consider voyaging all the more purposefully and less frequently, if at any point the world starts to appear to be like its pre-pandemic days. Make a move. Check the Transformational Travel Council for assets and suggestions on administrators who can help put together significant excursions. Number 4. The excursion will get going for some. Excursions might be the solitary achievable alternative for movement at this moment, and regular flyers like Gabby Beckford of Pax Light are firing up. Driving across state lines can be similarly pretty much as energizing as flying across worldwide lines, it's about the mentality. Traveling has shown me that the center of movement, interest, openness to freshness, and miracle, is, a viewpoint, not an objective, she says. Make a move. Plan a COVID-cognizant excursion to Colorado, home to standout stargazing locales, and what may turn into the world's biggest dark skyhold. Number 3. Travel counselors will get fundamental Condé Nast Traveler Supportability Supervisor Juliet Kinsman predicts a shift to booking travel through specialists and set up administrators, taking note of their important information and industry associations. I think what 2020 has appeared and encouraged us is the mastery and monetary insurance of booking through a travel planner regularly exceeds the sum you pay in commission, she says. Moreover, she trusts that customers will look to specialists who have practical experience in the climate. The individuals who care about where they send their clients can instinctively slice through greenwash and truly guarantee each connection in the store network is a noteworthy one, she says. Number 2. We'll like remaining nearer to home some are finding the advantages of movement even at home. Blogger Jesse Festa of Epicure and Culture and Jesse on a journey typically ventures universally once every month. Nowadays, online social cooking classes, games, and virtual encounters are helping all her the soul of movement alive by considering the sentiments that movement inspires, she says. Trading postcards with her all-encompassing travel local area is another lovely approach to experience travel once more, securely, she adds. At the point when we contrast everything with being secured up inconclusively our individual pinnacles, a stroll to the recreation center can feel like travel, says blogger Chris Mitchell of Traveling Mitch. Presently individuals will see the enchantment in a supper on a porch at a cafe down the road. Make a move. Get outside, says the Norwegian idea, Friluftsliv, a thought of open air living that vows to make the pandemic's colder months more tolerable. Number 1. Arranging excursions will become happy once more albeit a few group are making the awesome being grounded. This troublesome period is advising them that movement is significant for boosting psychological well-being and self-awareness. There's exploration to back it up. A 2013 overview of 483 U.S. grown-ups found that movement improves compassion, energy, consideration, and core interest. Arranging an outing is similarly as successful. A 2014 Cornell study showed that anticipating travel significantly expands joy, more than expecting purchasing material products. Joanna Penn can bear witness to the recuperating advantages of both. The UK-based writer and podcaster behind the creative pen and books and travel ordinarily goes to explore her books. For me my career as a writer is about what I realized when I travel, she said in a new digital recording, the thoughts that come from being somewhere new. Her future outings will remember strolling the Camino de Santiago for 2022. 
Examining maps and deciding a course causes her to feel like she's pursuing a genuine objective. I can grow my usual range of familiarity without a lot pressure, particularly in the event that I acknowledge that things may get dropped, she said.